Have you ever wondered what goes into designing a powerful modern tank? Imagine a battlefield vehicle that combines speed, strength, and resilience, one that serves as the backbone of a country's defense. In this video, we're diving deep into Italy's impressive answer to these challenges, the Ari Eat main battle tank. Created by two of Italy's finest engineering giants, this tank has everything a modern army could need. From its powerful armament to its sleek design and impressive defense systems, the Ari Eat is truly a tank built to endure. Stay with us as we uncover the story behind this remarkable machine, reveal its secrets, and discover what makes the Ari Eat such a standout on the battlefield. You won't want to miss this journey into one of Italy's finest armored creations. In the early 1980s, Italy's leading defense companies, Otio Malara and Iveco Fiat, had a vision to create a modern fighting machine that would combine their expertise and support the needs of the Italian army. Together, they formed the Consorzio Iveco Otto Malara, or CIO, in 1984, with the goal of creating a new generation of battlefield systems that shared key components. This was not only a way to cut costs, but also a strategy to simplify logistics and make maintenance easier for Italy's ground forces. The partnership's vision was ambitious. Instead of designing just one vehicle, they would create an entire family of military machines. This would include the Dardo Infantry Fighting Vehicle, the Centauro 8x8 Tank Destroyer, and the main focus of today's story, the Ari Eat Main Battle Tank, often referred to as the Battering Ram. By sharing automotive components across these platforms, CIO aimed to make each of these vehicles highly reliable, efficient, and affordable to maintain. When it came to designing the RE Eat, CIO split responsibilities between the two companies. Otio Malara took charge of the overall design, engineering, and the production of the tank's main gun. IV Co Fiat, on the other hand, was responsible for the power pack, which included the engine and transmission. This setup allowed each company to contribute its best skills to the project. The RE Eat is a sight to behold, a truly imposing machine weighing 60 tons. But what's even more impressive than its weight is the power it packs under the hood. Originally, it was fitted with a 1,275 horsepower V12 MTCA turbocharged diesel engine. This allowed the tank to travel at speeds of up to 40 miles per hour, an impressive feat for a vehicle of its size. Later, Iveco improved the engine's power, boosting it to a formidable 1,600 horsepower making it more efficient and even faster on different terrains. The engine, located at the rear of the vehicle, powers a torsion bar suspension system that provides the RE Eat with excellent stability, even on rough or uneven ground. This system, along with its road wheels, drive sprocket, and track idler, allows the RE Eat to tackle a variety of landscapes, from rugged hillsides to open plains. The suspension system also gives the crew a smoother ride, an important feature when operating in challenging environments. The tank's armament is its true highlight. At the heart of the RE Eat is a powerful 120mm L44 smoothbore gun, designed by Oto Malara. This gun is capable of firing NATO standard rounds, meaning the RE Eat can use the same ammunition as other NATO allies, a critical advantage in coalition operations. With the ability to rotate 360 degrees, this main gun allows the tank to strike targets at any angle, providing full battlefield coverage. Supporting the main gun are two 7.62mm machine guns. One is mounted coaxially with the main gun, allowing it to be used in tandem for engagements requiring rapid response, while the other is positioned on the turret roof, providing anti-aircraft defense. This gives the RE Eat comprehensive firepower, capable of defending itself against both ground and aerial threats. The layout of the RE Eat's crew is carefully designed to maximize efficiency and safety. The driver sits at the front right of the hull, while the commander, gunner, and loader are located in the turret. This arrangement ensures each crew member can perform their role without interference, enabling them to focus on their specific tasks, whether it's steering, loading, targeting, or commanding. Safety and protection were top priorities in the RE Eats design. The tank uses a combination of steel and composite armor, giving it strong protection against high-explosive anti-tank, heat rounds. This armor scheme puts the RE Eat on par with tanks like the American M1 Abrams and British Challenger II, which are renowned for their toughness. CIO added modular armor to the RE Eat, meaning it can be enhanced with additional layers of armor depending on the mission requirements. This makes the RE Eat highly adaptable, allowing it to be configured for specific threats or environments as needed. To protect the crew from chemical, biological, or nuclear threats, the RE Eat is equipped with NBC, nuclear, biological and chemical protection. 
This system filters the air inside the tank, providing a safe environment for the crew in contaminated areas. Additionally, night vision equipment enables the crew to operate effectively in low light or nighttime conditions, an essential feature for modern combat. The RE EAT is also equipped with 2x4 smoke grenade dischargers, which the crew can use to create a smoke screen, hiding the tank's position from enemy forces. This is especially useful when the crew needs to withdraw under fire or reposition during an engagement. Another unique feature is the laser warning sensor, positioned near the loader's hatch. This sensor detects laser-guided threats, alerting the crew to incoming missiles and allowing them to take evasive action or deploy countermeasures. Building the RE EAT was a monumental task, and production took place at OTO Malara's facility in La Spezia. By 2002, CIO had completed the Italian Army's order of 200 units, with the tanks being organized into four active tank battalions. No foreign sales materialized, so the RE EAT remains an Italian exclusive, dedicated to protecting Italy's interests and sovereignty. Since its introduction in 1995, the RE EAT has served as a reliable and powerful asset for the Italian army. Its digital fire control system allows for precise targeting and enables the main gun to stay on target even while moving, a capability known as firing on the move. This gives the RE EAT an edge on dynamic battlefields where stationary targets are rare. Throughout its years of service, the RE EAT has proven itself to be both resilient and adaptable. Its ability to traverse rugged terrain, maintain high speeds, and engage targets with pinpoint accuracy makes it a formidable force. The tank's design and components are a testament to Italian engineering, blending power, precision, and protection. The 120mm main gun remains the RE EAT's primary weapon, with an arsenal of 40 shells carried aboard. These rounds provide the tank with extensive firepower, allowing it to take on fortified positions, enemy vehicles, and various battlefield threats. The tank also carries 2,400 rounds for the machine guns, ensuring it has ample ammunition for both offensive and defensive situations. The RE EAT's advanced fire control system incorporates a dual-axis stabilized main gun and digital targeting, giving it excellent accuracy and effectiveness, even while on the move. This makes the RE EAT capable of keeping up with modern armored warfare tactics, where agility and responsiveness are crucial. The RE EAT MBT embodies Italy's approach to defense, a blend of modern technology, skilled engineering and thoughtful design. It serves as a reminder of what Italy's defense industry can achieve when working together to create solutions tailored to the needs of modern military forces. The RE EAT main battle tank is more than just a machine, it's a powerful symbol of Italian engineering and innovation. From its well-armored exterior to its advanced weaponry and reliable engine, the RE EAT stands as a testament to Italy's commitment to modern warfare. If you enjoyed learning about the RE EAT's capabilities and history, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Hit the like button, and let us know in the comments what you think of Italy's impressive main battle tank. Is there another armored vehicle you'd like to see covered? Your feedback helps us bring you the content you love. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more deep dives into the world of military technology.